Hey Sarah, today is going to be another lazy vlog because I have no time. I've already wasted time today and I've got so much stuff to get done. So yeah, hopefully this will be a one take. I've got a timer going on here so I won't have to go over time and then have to edit this because I really don't have any time at all. Um, let's see. I'm going to just do some quick updates and just kind of blabber on for about five minutes because... Yeah, stuff is happening and I think you'd like to know about it and it's so much easier to talk than have to like message you about it because there's just, it's harder to get information across in the way that you want it in messaging and when I talk there's inflection so it's like, oh, that's what I mean with emotions when I say that sentence. Yeah, so pretty much today I took my drive test and I failed it, which sucks a lot. <laughs> yeah, um... The stupid part about it is I failed at something called backing around a corner, which is where you pull to the side and then you have to back right around a corner to the right around a corner. And you have to also do it right, as in correctly, so I guess it's a double meaning. I just wanted to make it clear which right I was referring to, but pretty much I did really badly. I actually got two wheels up on the curb, which meant that I automatically failed. Which really sucks because everything up till that point I had done perfectly. Yeah, and the reason why I'm kind of disappointing is because I know for a fact that I'm quite capable of doing that. It's just that in that one instance I did really, really terribly. Probably like the worst I've ever actually done at backing around a corner because I don't think I've ever gotten two wheels up on the curb before, but that time I did. Which, I don't know, it happens. In two weeks, I'll be able to take the drive test again. Not because that's how long it takes, but because they're just really busy and that's the next time that it's available. Yeah, I don't... Yeah, <laughs> that happened today and it's kind of annoying because it's supposed to... I'm supposed to start driving at 8 and then it took until like... No, 8.30. Yeah, I was supposed to start driving at 8.30 and it took until 9 o'clock to actually start driving. So then I also wasted a bunch of time and I'm really, really busy because college. Even though I'm just going to go... Sorry, that made no sense. Let me start over. Even though right now I'm just going to community college, which is different from a university in some way that I don't really understand, but it's so busy. Like, literally what you normally learn a a year you're learning in a third of that time so in my English class I have to write a paper every two weeks three to five pages and the last one is five to seven pages and then I'm taking a nutrition class and I just had my first test last week and that was from chapters one till four and they don't give you a break to review or anything they're just like okay here's the last thing you learned and the next day we're going to test you on it which is so much fun as in not I actually it was all multiple choice so that's kind of nice and I got like a 90, 91% on it, which is okay. I would have liked to do better, but that's pretty good. But the class average was 70%, which is kind of scary. What I'm kind of learning through college is that so far I've kind of gotten by just by like doing what I normally do, but I don't actually try significantly. Like I try hard, but I don't work like really hard to do stuff. And now I'm like, oh, I'm actually going to have to work really really hard all the time and I can never take breaks so yeah on the weekends I'm just like okay what's the billion things that I have to do okay I'm starting to run out of time now so I've got to think of a question of the day um 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 I don't know how's life for you what's up I know that you started school recently Sarah um yeah for everyone else just what's something that you've been doing probably work for all the adults and probably school for all the students because that's what we do all the time <laughs> which is kind of sad that's just life yeah which is why i'm a personal believer that you should love what you're doing and be really passionate about it especially when you go into work because you're going to be doing that most of the time so it should be something that you think is important and that you really like or else all of that time is just going to be a waste and even if you do what you like in your spare time it's kind of like what you're doing the most is something that you dislike which sounds awful anyways um i'm almost out of time so i'm sorry sarah that this video is bad but seriously i have absolutely no time okay the end